Okay, now we're going to tell you about one of my new favorite games this year, and it's called Duple. It's from the makers of Anomia, which was one of our best-selling games last year, and it's one of my new favorite games. So how it's played, it's kind of similar to Anomia, just a little different. There are three different types of cards. There's a category card that you start out with. There's also a wild card that you start out with, and then there are the normal playing cards that are orange up top. So you start out the game by flipping over the category card and also the wild card. So th for this round, we are going to, we are looking for an adjective and we are also looking for these two symbols. So how you play is all the players take turns drawing cards and laying them in front of them. What you're looking for, each of the cards has a letter on it and it also has a symbol. Once your card matches another player in the game's cards with this symbol, or if both of you have one of these symbols, then you both have to yell out an, a word that has these two letters in it that is, in this instance, an adjective. So we will continue to draw the cards until ours match. Oh. But I have so you, so she wild. has so now she has this purple wild. So if I need to watch for either me to draw one of these purple ones or for me to draw this orange circle so now card. No, I say an adjective. Well, not yet because your, yours has to match one of mine. Yes. Both of us are racing. Yes. So once I draw, so this wild card will now replace that one. So say you draw this card. We both have a card that matches this. Now it's a race for both of us to name an adjective that has two E's in it. It has to have both of the letters from our cards. Sleek. Sleek. That was a great one. I've been thinking she, for a while. <laughs> she beat me to it though. I was thinking too. So, and so then as soon as that person beats the next person, she gets to take my entire discard pile. And she's, and so you're trying to build up on cards. First person out of cards loses. And then the winner obviously will have the most cards at the end of the match. Throughout this deck, there are many cards. The category cards are also mixed throughout the deck. As soon as those category cards come up, you just replace this one. Once a blank category card comes up, then that it is that person's choice as to which category they would like to do. I personally want to do an animal because I think that's easier than an adjective. Yes. So we and then the same the same with the wilds. If a wild card pops up, you just replace that one and then you draw the next card in the deck. So this one is now that. And so now Candace and I will continue to play and we'll see who can win this game. Alrighty. So put it on top of your pile. There you go. We're playing for an animal, correct? We're playing for an animal. Oh, a dog! Dragon. Dog! Dragon! 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 Dog! I said dog first. <laughs> a D energy. <laughs> Any animal. <laughs>